In this video, I will be going uh, over the uh, requirements and the new uh, program that I'm doing. It is for the title of the Hala Dala Money in Motion Challenge. <music> You give me an offer and I'll take it with no problem. I got an offer. I got the dollars. Let me have it, please. I got the dollars. Let them have it. You got the dollars? We got the offer? Let them have it with no problem. Let them have it. Well, here at Cajun Roots Reseller, if you're on a fixed income, even if it's on a sale, in the Cajun Roots Reseller eBay store, Guess what? Send an offer. Let him have it. Have it with no problem. All right, in this video, I will be going uh, over the uh, requirements and the new uh, program that I'm doing. It is for the title of the Hala Dala Money in Motion Challenge. And if this is your first time coming and this, you just come to the channel for the first time, I want to thank you for coming and finding the channel and coming and spending your time with me. As well as, in, if you haven't um, done this before, it is free. There is a the subscription button below the video. And as well as there's a bell, there's three. Make sure you hit the top one. That way you get all notifications no matter what I come out with. No matter if it's a pre-recorded, a live, a bingo, uh, you name it. Whatever it comes out with, it'll, you'll get the notifications first. And then again, if you're returning, I want to thank you so much for constantly coming back and, and showing your love and support to the channel. And in also, in lieu of uh, supporting to the channel, uh, in the description bars below, you will find there is a tree link. In that tree link, every link that I have, whether it's an affiliate link, if it's to buy me a cup of coffee, uh, if it's to just buy merchandise, like what I have behind me here. I'll have this, like the little coffee cups right here. Uh, I have all that merchandise. You're more than welcome to help yourself with that. And again, very little cost of profit that I make. Um, and this is just one of the ways that we can help support the channel. Uh, and this is for everybody to collaborate and network, just like I do in the morning show, but just with a twist. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, in the, uh, in the video that I'm gonna be to go discussing is how and what's gonna happen on the Hala Dala Money in Motion Challenge. I did have my first run already. And again, that was something I've definitely learned uh, for the first time, first day and it was chaos so uh, I have to say now that I do uh, appreciate and honor all the nice uh, comments that I got um, but I did think about of what can change on this because it definitely needed to have some changes I was a little crazy in, in, in going back and forth and doing all the things I thought I can do right and so what I did was um, came up with some uh, uh, good solid little rules uh, and change a couple of things where it maybe it might run a little smoother but also I had someone reach out to me and so now as of this new show we will have two new co-hosts i had someone reach out to me so uh, we kind of talked about everything and so we lined it up with those will be two co-hosts with me now the first one will be dawn from two hip chicks and as you may know it's dawn and mary and the other one is victoria with adventures with victoria and what we'll do is from the beginning we will start going through um having to, you know introducing everybody and then when the, the show starts uh, I will be typing the words go when we talk about the links that you can drop Once you say the word I will say the word go but I'll also type it in the chat That once you see that go in the chat You can have your link and I will make sure that it's not in slow mode That way when you do the links you can put it in as soon as we do say go and What we're gonna do is we do take the first six now there won't be any time limits or anything like that We will go over it three times of all, all the six now if for some reason when um We've had Sandy Kirk as a great help in the chat where she's been putting the word stop. So once you see the word stop, we, want, we will not be taking any more links until the next round. We'll be doing these in rounds, by the way. And as we do the rounds, and say you're in round one, once you drop your six links, now if for some reason, when I say stop, and then Sandy or whoever puts the word stop in the chat, say for example, 
we hit the word stop and there might be six, seven, eight, nine people within that time frame because of the lag. Uh, so was, there is going to be a lag. Uh, usually, uh, my lags are about eight seconds. So I'm not going to do the slow mode. And this way here, you have a chance to put your link in the chat. Once that stop comes out, whoever is from between the go and the stop, if it's more than six, we'll take them. Then we'll go ahead and uh, either Victoria or Dawn will then pull the links from the chat, put them in the private chat for me in the stream yard. Then I will take one at a time and I will put them onto my computer and I will share my screen, talk about the, pro the item, show the pictures. If there's multiple pictures, I'll show all the pictures. And then talk a little bit about what I see, talk about the price, talk about the shipping, whether it's free shipping or plus shipping. Uh, and then from there we'll go and I'll keep showing all six, eight, nine, how many ever make it between the go and the stop. Uh, we, we're not going to be mandating that it has to be six because um, we know how the internet works when it comes to the chat. Once that is done and we go through and then you sell something, and I will go over this in the charts a little bit later, the chart is going to have four brackets, but we're only going to do two brackets because on what, I'm, what we, do, we decided after our first show together on Wednesday night, we came up with a solution, Robert helped us, we kind of bounced things off of each other to where we're going to do, instead of it being the buyers against the sellers on both sides, it's just going to be the sellers. Once the sell, something is sold, they get put on the chart. Once the 16 line cal, uh, uh, chart is filled on one chart, every time somebody buys something on the buy side, it doesn't matter how many times you buy from somebody, uh, if you want to purchase and you buy it and we verify it, you will be on the buy side. Now, the difference of the two is the, two, the, the 16 that will be on the side that you sold, once we get all 16 brackets filled, which we just did uh, yesterday, uh, and I'm just doing this as an uh, update for the rest of my video. Uh, we did have almost, actually we did fill up the first 16 for the first bracket and started on the second bracket. And again, this is a little bit later because I have been putting pieces together on this video as we fine tune it. So this is where I want to go ahead and get that into this video and have it done and out this weekend. So now if you're on the buy side, no matter how many times, you're just going to keep putting your name on, the, on, the, on every level we go. And I'll explain that in the chart when I go to the chart. Um, because there's a lot of buyers that don't buy, I mean, don't sell, but they buy. And so that was brought up in one of the comments and, the, and that's why we're doing the way we are doing it and doing a little fine tuning and kinkings here and there is because there's been some comments and questions in the chat. So with that being said, we'll go ahead and do the 16 brackets of who sold, fill the first one, go down to the second one, get those 16. And then of course, as we sellers of the buying people are buying from the uh, people in the chat, we'll put them on the buyer side. Once we get to the second bracket, we'll fill all 16 again, at the same time filling the buyer side. Now, again, I will show all of this in the chat below. Once we go through the first round, and then we say, okay, it's done, it's over, whoever sold or whatever, then we'll start taking those down after I've gone at least three times to show everything about it if somebody has a question or anything like that. Now, the interesting thing that I'm putting out to this for this portion, if for some reason, you're having something on that you're showing from your platform and somebody goes to your link, whoever it may be, is, let's put a link, and somebody goes there, but they may not like what you posted on the challenge, if they go into your store and buy something, let us know that you purchased something from somebody who put a link in the chat. Now, I'm not talking about if you make a sale while you're on the show. We're not talking about anything else. We're only talking about those that are in the chat helping and supporting the channel in the duration of the show. If you sell something that somebody bought other than what you listed, that'll count as a point that you get on the board. And then, of course, the person who bought it out of the chat will get on the buy side. And so what we'll do is if you're in round one and then we go to round two, the only thing I ask is that you at least stay out from round two for those who are in round one. Don't post anything in round two when we say go because that gives others in the chance a ch in the chat chance to put their link in so thinking maybe to try to sell something and then so forth and f so forth so on and so forth each round I just ask that you skip a round so if you listed in one please don't listen two. if you're in two don't list in three and so forth on after that and so I do want to say that once this happens I'll go over the short the chart and show you more of how that's going to work 
it's almost like the March Madness where they fill, they already have the basketball teams filled up and then they all play against each other and they go from the 16 to the 8 and then from the 8 to the 4 and then the 4 to the 2. And that's basically some of what's going to happen, except on the buyer side, it's just going to keep adding up with the buyers. We're not having the buyers compete against each other, but what they are going to be competing against is if in bracket one, you once we do that, we'll put you in a drawing. That drawing will get you a prize. Now, we're going to be giving away two prizes because there's two brackets. One um, uh, thing we did come up with was that uh, Dawn will uh, offer a prize from one bracket, and Victoria is going to offer a prize for the second bracket. So that way we'll have two separate winners for all those that are buying that gives you a chance in the drawing to get that prize. Now, as far as the sellers are concerned, those are the ones that's going to battle against each other after both 16s of the two brackets are filled. And then what we'll do from there is then each person will then battle it out to try to see who can sell of the two. That way they'll become on the next row of the eight. So I'll go over that in the chart to give you more clarifications. And again, if you have any questions, please feel free to put them in the chat at the bottom of the, the, the description of the of video in the chat section where you can make comments. Uh, and I will ask, I will answer them for you. I will check them out and make sure that I do can, I'll get to you on those. That's one thing about my videos. Every time I goes up, I do check to see if somebody's commented. When I get a notification, I'll go check it out, read it. And if there's a comment or question, I'll answer them as well. All right. And as far as once the links are pulled, once we get either to six or whatever is between the start and stop, at that point, when you see the word stop, we ask that you do not put any of the links in the chat. Uh, while we're working those, those whether it's six to nine or whatever, how many make it between the starting goes, uh, I'm not just making it at six. But what I'm, I am asking is that once we do say stop, please do not put any more links in the chat. I don't want to see no um, YouTube channel links because that will confuse everybody in the chat because we're going to be working those links to show what it is and then to the, those who are in the chat that want to buy from everybody and, and help everybody out. So I ask that you don't put any links until I say go again the next round. Now what I'm asking also, the reason I'm asking for you to do the links at the end of the show is because that way we won't bombard the chat the whole time with other links. So with that being said, at the end of the video or the end of the live, there will be a time around 5.30ish um, that depending on how soon the brackets get filled and we get depending on where we're at on a round. Uh, when that happens close to or thereafter, I would then say, okay, uh, when I say go and put your links in the chat to either your special events, uh, event you're having going on on your sh YouTube channel, or even on a platform if you're having a sale, whatever the case may be. Uh, also, I do want to make sure and clarify when you're doing a link, I don't want you to put the link because I've had some people put a link where it's their whole page or their whole store or their whole Facebook marketplace. That's not what we want. We want a individual single listed item uh, when you do put it in the chat. And again, making sure that we can uh, get to it. We just make sure that you are not using the link to your whole page. And so that is very important because then we have to stop, delete it, and have you come back in and put another link. So just make sure when you're doing this, it is a link from one single uh, sell item, not your whole store or not your whole platform or wherever it is you sell on. You can have this item for you on your flat platform you're selling on. It can be a, a sale item. Uh, you can offer a discount. It's up to you. But the only thing I do ask is that whatever you list, it has one of, not multiples. Uh, I prefer but not required that you may have maybe something if you have that's over 120 days. I know some of us are fairly new, so you wouldn't have that. But again, that's not required. And as far as the platforms are concerned, you can do any platform you have uh, it could be uh, Facebook Marketplace, it can be eBay, Macari, Etsy. The only one I'm asking you not to use is if you have some type of cross like Vindu or Bonanza. Bonanza in itself is a, a, a platform, but you actually are importing from other platforms to one. All right, now as far as when an item is sold, what I need for you to do is when you're in the chat and you actually had your turn to put your link in the chat and someone purchased it if you are a buyer you can go in the chat and say i bought uh, and actually first what we need you to do is either at cajun or at basically maybe victoria or at dawn at two hip chicks which whichever one of us can catch it to show that you uh, bought something uh we ask that you only use those screen names that are in the chat don't use their real names especially if you have uh received their information or their payments we don't want that into the chat because we don't want their real information being put out. So based on if you bought something, it'd be great if you put in there. I bought from 
at Victoria, at Victoria, at Victoria, at Victoria uh, with Victoria, and then at whoever you bought it from. Uh, that way, we, then we can start looking at verifying it, because then we have to refresh in that page, make sure it was sold, and who was. And then from that point on, then we will take those names for whoever sold it, put it on the chart, and whoever bought it, put it on the chart on the buy side. That way, that will help us verify quicker, and then we can move on to others. And I'll delete that link from my viewing that I'm doing during that portion of the six or eight or nine or whatever makes it between the start and stop sign. Hey, listen, don't don't leave. Wait to the end. You want to see this new Cajun Roots Resellers bloopers. Uh, so with that being said, let's go ahead and get ready to do the chart. Uh, that way you can see uh, how that will work in this portion. All right. Now here's the chart that I'm going to show you. Um, when I say bracket, we have the first 16 here. This is bracket one. So this is the bracket side where if you sold something, you will be on this bracket. We do only have 16 slots to start with. So therefore, we did fill the first 16. Now, if you were a buyer, we have it on the right side. And therefore, this whole top section is bracket one. Now, what's going to happen is every one of the ones that are in the brackets you see here, those are the ones that actually want a sale from the week. Now, starting once we get, and I'll show you bracket two in a second. Once we get all these 16 done on both bracket one and bracket two, then this will be the next step that we do. So here we have the 16 that won the first round of bracket one. Therefore, Nana Tank is on the top, and then of course we have Cindy Roach. They, they two will then now come back, when it goes back to this portion, they will battle it out to see who would win out of them two and sell the first item of what they show in the chat there. Now what we can do is, what I'm thinking of doing, is at that time we'll make it sure that these eight people are in the chat for that day if and for some reason they're not we'll go to anyone that has a combination of the two to complete that round and we'll need to complete all those rounds and get from the 16 in the first column whoever wins from each one of the brackets will then come down to the next row so say for example out of these two say cindy wins well then cindy becomes here now then, of course, anybody from uh, from Adventures in Reselling or Pam, if they win, Victoria, if say she won, and she sold first before them two, then, of course, Victoria would go here, and then so forth all the way down. Now, as far as the buyers, each one of these will be filled. And as we go to the next row to fill of the eight, whoever buys from them will then be putting their name here. And we'll keep filling out this whole side, because once this side is filled with those who bought they will not be competing. They will, however, to go down as far as the actual challenge part. But this portion will be was that as an incentive for them buying, they would then be in a drawing to win one of two prizes. And so that's what we're doing with the winners. Now, as far as the, the sellers, we will work it down from the eight, and then they will buy these two, whoever's in these two lots of the bracket will then fight it for the next round. So therefore, we're going to go from 16 to eight, when those eight are done, we'll go from the eight down to four. When these are done, whoever wins out of these two will go here. Whoever wins out of these two will go here. And so forth and so forth, so on and so forth. Now, as far as once, now we have the first bracket filled, we're working on the second bracket. So as you see, this is bracket left, bracket right of the first one. Then what we're going to do is go down to the bottom. You see the little uh, tro trophy in the center. What will happen now is... I'll go down to the 16 here, so we can see them all right there. Now, as you see here, we already have four from the last show of the week, which was Friday, which was yesterday. So every Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern is when it takes place. So this right here is where we're going to finish these next 16 brackets here. We already have the first two sets filled. So that means now we have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 brackets left. Once we get those 12, again, once on the seller side and once on the buyer side, then we'll go again. And again, once this is done, then we're going to go to all of the double brackets to go down to 8 on top bracket 1 and bracket 2. And again, the same procedure that I just showed before will happen in this bracket from uh, 16 to 8, from 8 to 4, from four to two, and then from the two to one. Now what's gonna happen once we get to this one here, 
Remembering, everybody who buys is going to have a drawing on the bottom as well. So you have two brackets, two drawings. So it doesn't matter how many times you're on that side because that gives you more chances to win the prize. Now, Dawn from Two Hip Checks and Victoria from Victoria Adventures with Victoria, they're going to do one gift or one, one prize each. And that'll be from each bracket. So you'll have two ch chances to win. Now, as far as this bracket, once we get to here, that person, whoever gets in this bracket, will then have their challenge with whoever makes it in this bracket. So those two will then come here. And therefore, at this point, we won't need anybody here because whoever comes in this part after these two is the actual winner. Because on this side, it's all those who are going to win. And what's going to happen is, once we get to this row here, we'll then have whoever wins out of these two will be the, the, the two winners of the whole package because that's when we'll do the drawing. So once we get all these filled on this side, we'll do that as far as when whoever's here will win from the bottom bracket. And then whoever is here is the winner from the top bracket of the buyer side. Hopefully that clarifies how we do in the brackets. And again, if you have any questions, you're, feel free to uh, send me a message through the comments below, and I'll be glad to. Or you can just send me a new message on all my uh, social medias or in the descriptions of the videos, and as well as my link tree. And you're more than welcome to contact me, and I'll help you uh, clarify any questions or concerns you may have. All right, one more thing I want to say before I uh, end the video. I want to thank each and every one of you for always coming out and show, showing your love and support for the channel. Also, don't forget in the description bar below, I do have a link tree link. And in that link, I have everything from affiliate links to all my merchandise that I sell off of eBay, as well as affiliate links that you can support. And if you use those affiliate links, like for Canva or Filmora, um, buy me a cup of coffee, uh, a Printful, where I get all my merchandise. If you use those links, you receive something and I receive something, whether it's a coupon, points, um, Merchandise uh, uh, percentages off of merchandise, whatever it may be. Those are all in the description bar below inside my link tree. Uh, and again, if you feel that you would like to support the channel, um, the buy me a coffee or any of the merch will be a great idea to um, be able to have you enjoy your items from supporting the channel with merchandise. And so um, please do me one favor before you do leave. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up, but also make sure you're subscribed. But if you hit that bell, the subscribe button right next to it, Make sure you do see that all notifications are set. That'll be the very of the three. There's a very top one. That way you will not miss any videos, no matter if it's a pre-recorded or a live or a game or anything like that or auctions. You never know um, on the channel. And again, I want to thank each and every one of y'all. My sub count is getting larger. It is all due to the fact that all of you keep coming back, supporting the channel and having your questions and answers. And I enjoy answering questions either where it's in the morning show with the coffee show. Uh, it's 9 o'clock a.m. Eastern every day, Monday through Friday. But I do rotate that, which will be in the description bar below as well, uh, with Trent, with the thrifting, thrifter, Thrifty Picker, with the Pickers with a Z. All that will be in the description bar below, by the way. And every Monday, Wednesday, Friday is on my channel, and now we do rotate with Trent. Uh, and we did this so I can start doing this type of, of uh, program and um, get back to the community, do a little bit more extra. And so with that being said, thank you so much for coming and watching the video. And like I said, any and all of my videos I would like to end it with is love always. Love is always free. Please be kind to one another until we meet into another chat. Have a fabulous and blessed day. Later. Guess what? This is the moment you've been waiting for. Here is now a bit of the Cajun Roots Resellers bloopers. So with that being said, thank you so much. Have a blessed day. And like I always say before, and in, in all my videos, love one another. Love is always free. Love one another. Please be kind to one another until we meet into another chat. Have a fabulous and blessed day. And see you on the Holla Dollar Money, Money Emotion uh, Challenge. Later. See you next time on the... <laughs> Take three. We'll have to see you now. Hopefully, oh, Lord Jesus. I want some bloopers on this one. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, hopefully you are enjoying the holla dollar in motion, money in motion. Ah. <laughs> now, I hope you come back and enjoy the actual holla dollar money in motion challenge and see if you can sell, who can sell, if you, ugh. And see how far you can go with selling items and see if you can become the champion of the holla dollar 
Money in Motion Challenge. Later. Thank you.